for those of you that may have missed it, I'm very sorry to inform you that the following clip is very real. Yes, not doctored, not edited. It's 100% authentic. Check it out. His trip overseas, just leaving Finland a short time ago on his way back from the United States. More analysis on his performance on the world stage. And We've moved on from sniffing to nibbling. <laughs> I mean, you guys, this is, this is the, the highest power in the whole world. The president of the U.S. He's nibbling kids. Anyone else got a problem with this yet? <laughs> it's not funny. It's not funny at all. Happy Thursday. Welcome to this education. Welcome to another episode of Try Not to Laugh. Guys, if you're new here, if you laugh, you lose, but there are no punishments. All right, I'm testing you out. We're warming you up for our Sunday games where if you laugh, you lose, you would do a punishment. Because there's no laughing in these times. We have a guy in the White House nibbling kids. We shouldn't be laughing at anything right now. It's not okay. If you use YouTube Shorts and you want to get some highlights, some of our favorite moments from Zeducation over the years, head over to Zeducation Shorts and subscribe there, where we will be posting a few times a day. But first, before you go and do that, we got to play today's game. If you're ready for today's game, head down and like this video. And if you're new here, please make sure you are subscribed and have the bell clicked for notifications when new videos are uploaded. Now on to today's game. Try not to laugh. Go. Okay, so so they found that bag in a cubby at the White House, and they're hitting us with the... In the goddamn White House. There's no camera that can go boop, boop, boop. Oh, that guy put it there. <laughs> All I know is that if that bag was found in my house and I said, they would start the investigation by kicking my ass. <laughs> Nobody knows. We have no idea whose it was, guys. Nobody knows. Even with all the cameras around there, just not, no idea. There's a, literally not even a clue. <laughs> it's funny and not funny because people are in prison for stuff like this, but it's okay when it's in the White House. It's not even a big deal. It's funny. No way I got this on record. What the hell's... Kick it into four. What are you doing? Oh, come on. Uh... No, that... Ew. How does this happen so often? Like, all the time we get these boat ramp fails. It... You'd think they'd learn from each other. Uh, <laughs> wipers going on. <laughs> Come on, jet ski push. What are you doing? Help him out here. Damn, son. Oh, man. Mmm. 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 I just I feel bad for him. I do. But that's what happens when you're at the boat ramp and you, you don't have any experience. And you shouldn't be operating a, a trailer. Yikes. Let alone a car. Man. Great fielders in Creed Corps. Look at this. Kid reaches over. Oh. And saves his seatmate oh. from getting plunked right in the right forehead. In the oh, face. dude. <laughs> Check your lips. He's hit. Don't be mad. He saved your face. He saved your face. Look at this. You know, I will say maybe he might have blinded his friend. That's why he caught it. His friend may have caught it if he didn't have his glove right in between his eyes, the line of sight of the ball. But nonetheless, he didn't get plucked in the face, man. Saved you a couple stitches. Point of view, there's drama in your neighborhood, and you want to know the T. All those people. And then there's just this. <laughs> hey, maybe he... Maybe he wants to know it all. Maybe we get a, you know, courtside seat to the drama. Or he's just minding his own damn business and his car just happens to be there. Could be either or. We don't know. He's going to get the drama whether he wants to or not. Oh, I love these ones. What do we got? It looks like kids. I see footprints. Oh, my. Oh, 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 oh my. <laughs> At least they're having fun, you know? At least they're having a good time. Oh, that's a lot of work, though. That's a lot of cleanup. <sighs> Guess you shouldn't have left that. That's your fault, parent. You shouldn't have left that five-gallon bucket 
laying around, man. Your problem. July 4th, America vs. Well, go hell yeah. Y'all know what today is? It's America's birthday! Woo! Freedom! Come on America! 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 Do you know what rhymes with America? Colonialism. Read a book. <laughs> <laughs> well, you're supposed to stand! There's nothing more American than cheap crap made in China. Yep, China. There ain't nothing more American than a good old fashioned butt heavy. What do you mean they got bought out by a Brazilian company? <laughs> that ain't true. Fracking should be banned. Cottage cheese should be banned. Gas powered cars should be banned. Can you smell that? Freedom! <laughs> 1776, baby. That's the day George Washington and Christopher Columbus signed the Declaration of Independence. Let's get it! Freedom! <laughs> tax corporations. Tax the rich. Tax the schools. Tax the school children. Tax the president. Twice. Tax your mom. Tax, yeah. Well, you know, there's. it's funny on both sides, right? Who, who is this guy? Do we got a, a name on this guy? Dude Dad Vlog? Yeah, that's, that's funny. Obviously, one guy is more fun than the other. That's just a fact. What can you imagine being that miserable? Yeah, whatever. That good job. Nice comparison. Nice embellishments. Those are funny. Llama spit in the face. Check off the bucket list. Uh oh. Come here. I'll hold you. He's fucking eating your car. <laughs> eating my car. Maybe there's on back, something dead on it. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, that was hard. Ah. Oh. Oh, disgusting. Lesson learned. <laughs> I just realized, is that, does that baby have a mullet? Oh, that's a beautiful neck pillow. What's going on? I always dreamed of this happening. What? You always dreamed of it happening? I always wanted this to happen. I had shields on. Well, now it did. Now it did, and uh, you can... Mark it off your bucket list. Yeah, I, I, if that happened to me, I would have puked everywhere. <laughs> All right. That's a little weird, boys. But uh, at first, I genuinely thought this was fake. I thought it was like a, a blow-up doll or something. That guy's just manhandling his buddy. What the hell's wrong with you guys? Showing him how to swing. It's all in the hips. Take it from uh, Chubbs. Customer states, funny smell coming from car. Yeah. What is that? What the hell is that? Can we get? Can we pick it up here? Seat's broken too, so it won't slide. Oh, there we go. Oh my gosh! Is that a pack of meat? Oh, that's not. Okay, I thought it was gonna be tight. Oh! oh. <laughs> No. You're kidding me. Dude, that is gross. <laughs> You're cold. kidding me. I'm not touching that. All right. You know, if you're going to bring your car into the shop for a smell, don't you think you'd clean it out a little bit? You didn't, you missed that? It's like twice the size it should be? Oh, man. How long has that been in there? Count your groceries when you get home, folks. Help, sir. Interesting basketball setup there. <laughs> well, that's why you don't have that setup, because you airball and uh, you're gonna pop your ball. There you go. Okay, we got. <laughs> no one saw, lady. No one cares. Self checkout number two has got the red light on. Go help him. Actually, I, I will say, I have to give you props here. That's pretty cool. Pretty incredible there. Nice work. Nice work. Spidey sense right there. I'm trans femme non-binary and I'm pan romantic asexual. I'm not trying to be mean about it, but like I already have a problem with like there, there, and there. You feel me? And you over here telling me all these words. Yeah. Just saw an application with... um. Fair and fairy, like for fairies, people who think they're fairies, there's pronouns for them. I just learned that. You got to add that to your, your list of things you're supposed to know about everyone when no one even, can even spell the theirs right. You can't use the correct theirs. 
Now you have an infinite amount of pronouns to memorize. So there you go. Today I made a decision to go to the place where the people are. And I am so happy to report that whatever the opposite of fun is, that is what I'm having. They call that hell. Go to the Minnesota State Fair. Hell. A lot of people brag. They like to go to that place, but it's not a place worth going to. Go to the local county fair to get a, your little dose of it. You don't need that many people around you. That's it's terrible. It's a terrible idea. Point of view when you go to do the task that you asked your husband to do an hour ago. <laughs> Wait. Huh? I was just about to do it. Don't worry. Hey, that's BS, man. An hour? No, you guys, you sit and wait for five minutes, and then you start to go and do it. You don't give us enough time. That's a fact. You guys all do it. Point of view, you're left-handed. Yo, what's up, man? What's up, man? Yo, are you seriously left-handed? But, okay, don't even get me started with that. Like, left-handed people are more intelligent than the right-handed people. Yeah, okay. I, <laughs> I can't even handle this right now. Like, I'm left-handed. Oh, life is so much harder for me than door handles. When I go to restaurants, I have to sit on the, the left side of the table because I'm eating, and if I don't, then... I'm talking to you, Daniel. I'm talking to you. <laughs> left hand, I'm so left-handed. I have to push my pencil when I write, and my hand gets dirty. <laughs> Incredible. Incredible. Oh, hey. What are you doing? Dude, that was a tough shot. You smoked it. <laughs> That's a... Uh, that's me on the course. I don't know what the f is in these, but if anybody needs a tree pulled out of the ground, their house moved over a couple of inches, or a car repoed with my bare ass hands, call me. It's called uh, overdosing on caffeine. Is it right, Celsius? Or is it the Logan Paul drink? It's hop you up on caffeine. That's the secret. You're waiting for the green to clear? How far are you? <laughs> <laughs> 227, you're, you're waiting for the green to clear? You can get there. 227, let me zoom in on these people. 227. He's going to shank it, waiting guaranteed. Waiting for the green to clear. Guaranteed. In range, Tyler says. In range. Yeah, Jim, I've been following Tyler for six years. I haven't seen him hit a green outside 100 yards. He feels confident, though. You heard that tree? <laughs> Every time. Yeah, but the one time you, you go and do it while they're on the green, that's when you hit it straight and you almost hit them. So, my son was fine. Ouch, he wrecked himself. Is that a remote control car? <laughs> Come on. All right, well, uh, he's okay. I saw him get up. He's all right. What the hell is that dirt pile doing there, by the way? Oh, come on. What is going on with these? You shouldn't. Do not try to back that into like, please. You're gonna end up like that Honda earlier. Point of view, driving with your girlfriend. No. Oh, yeah. Parker, <laughs> stop! Ones. Parker, stop! You're gonna hit him! Stop! <laughs> I love these ones. I swear to God, my wife just did this. She literally just did this. I said, you know, you're you are the meme right now. You are the meme. <laughs> what? Well, come on! Really, dude? Is that just a little bit overboard, you think? Yeah, just a little bit. Worst possible outcome. What an idiot. Oh, that sucks. Hope that's uh hope that's your boat, not a buddy's. If I were your buddy, I'd be pretty pissed. Bro must be bored. Anybody wanna go to Ah! 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 
I know some of you are laughing at that way too hard right now. And that's not even funny. How I think I look when I am drunk dancing. What the hell? Is that Britney Spears? The old Britney Spears? How I actually look. Anyone check on her recently? Is she doing all right? Said this many times before, but... You know, maybe the conservatorship wasn't some sort of uh, power grab. Maybe her family truly was concerned and they were looking out for her best interests. I, maybe. Controversial take there. I know. This is my impression of a Keurig coffee maker. That we're watching this right now. It's so good so far. You know what? It's the best impression I've seen all day. <laughs> Spot on. <laughs> if a doctor gives you oh, three yes. pills and he says to take one every half an hour, how long passes before you finish all the pills? Like a time. Like? Around what, if you had to guess? Around like four. Four hours? No, three. Three. Three? All right, good. You almost messed up. You almost said four. That would have been bad. Do you know what shape the Pentagon is? Like the defense building for America? What shape? Um, like what shape is the building? Rectangular prism. Rectangular prism? That's insane, yes. Do you know what the capital of the USA is? The capital of the USA? Yeah, what is it? How the f I live in a country? I don't know. It's mm. a good question. That's a good question. How do you live in the public schools, right? At Justin the Watt, I have to say that. Best... Best account highlighting the worst things. I mean, I love that account. It's my favorite account. Go. Just go get the ball and put it up. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that guy must have been standing there just waiting for them to chuck that. I don't, you know, I, I said this before. I don't understand this trend of doing weird stuff in Walmart and, uh, you know, retail stores. Specifically back in like the sports aisle. Look at that, dude. You chucked that like seven aisles over. For what? You're lucky the guy was standing there. Otherwise, the video wouldn't have been funny. But point of view, DMV employees, when you bring the wrong paperwork, be like... Okay, ma'am, go ahead and remove your card and you should be all set. Make sure you go ahead and do this online next time, okay? It will save us a lot of time. My time as well. DMV.gov. DMV.gov. Thank you. Have a good one. Next, ma'am. You're here for what? For your license? Okay, what are we doing? Are, are we renewing? Are, did you lose it in your first time? What are we doing? I don't know what I, I don't know what that means. You said renewing? Okay, give me one second. You filled out that application? Perfect. Okay, if you're not, you're gonna have to go back and fill it out, okay? Did you bring the correct paperwork for the renewal? Yes, all the paperwork. I need to see it. Do you still live in this address? All right, let me go ahead and see the paperwork to verify it. Mm -mm. No, they do not match. Ma'am, if you have a question, you have to wait in line. Thank you. They do not match. This is not the correct paperwork. Uh-uh. I cannot receive this. You're going to have to come back. Mm. Man, uh, spot on impression there. Spot on impression, but that gives me anxiety. I hate going to those places. You get all these people that are on some sort of power trip. Follow, you know, bureaucracy. Ah, it's just blood pressure through the roof watching that. Been there a thousand times. Hate it. Nothing worse. Point of view. Your dad doesn't have money to spend on fireworks, but still wants to participate. <laughs> 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 
second best impression of the day. I still got to go with the coffee cure because that's, you know, your impression of fireworks is pretty good. He was not happy. You serve a bathroom. <laughs> He's waiting for himself to dry off. Once he dries off, you better run. That man is not happy. I wouldn't be either, dude. You're taking a slumber, a nice little snooze on the deck, enjoying the sunlight. Look at him. He's pissed. He should be. Shame on you from waking a man like that. I had to look three times. Got a semi-driver here. What's in the passenger seat? What the hell? I gotta look again here. Is that... Is that Charmander? Hey, look, I know the, the road gets a little lonely, but uh, Charmander? Whatever, dude. Whatever. Oh, I saw this. This is amazing. Check this out. One in a million right here. Chucking the ball off the rooftop. Dude, you are, that's a, uh, that's actually could be a problem. Fire hazard, maybe? I don't know. Oof. Yeah, you better go find out, dude. Lost a patient today. Oh, this clip, man. Taking a video of myself. Lost a patient today. No. Shake it off. You have five more hours. Nice. Yeah. Put some emotional music over that. You got a viral hit on your hands. Uh, <laughs> you should probably tell the family now, huh? Nurses. I, I don't know when this was exactly, but I remember when it went viral. Like, shame on this lunatic for videotaping herself. Oh, no, I lost a patient today, man. I lost a patient. Feel sorry for me. Feel sad for me. What the hell's wrong with you? How to look like you care for the environment. Part one, get your friend to film you filling up rubbish bags. Stupid. With sticks. Get the picture for your Instagram. Come on. Part two you now stick your butt out. an Oscar winning performance of you struggling in the wing. <laughs> I'm so happy someone videotaped this person. Get it for the gram, dude. Part three. Celebrate your good deed by doing a sh dance. <laughs> Part four. <laughs> leave rubbish bags behind once you're done. Oh, no way. Are you kidding me? Come on. Hey, but guess what? They got the pictures, right? They got the Instagram pictures. That's all that matters. Got to get the likes. Got to get the thumbs up. Maybe get a sponsor deal. You know, get a sponsored post on Instagram. There you go. That's how you do it. My salary. Inflation. Come on, get it. Yeah, she can't keep up. The old inflation. It's tough. They say it's going down, but... If you go to the grocery store, you know that's BS. You know, groceries are still incredibly expensive. Housing. How's your mortgage going? How's your rent going? Yeah. It's it's going down. I don't feel it. My paycheck still feels tiny compared to expenses. Taylor merch truck opening. There are two Swifties here who shall remain anonymous. Oh, come on. Who called in <laughs> sick to work. They traveled here from Louisville, so they've gotten quite a drive here. They've been here since about 2.45 in the morning. So can you tell me what Taylor Swift means to you? She must mean a lot to you because you're here and you've called in sick. That is very true. I almost named my daughter's middle name Taylor, so. Oh my goodness, I love it. Now, what are you hoping to snag at the merch truck here? Um, I want the gray quarter zip. Yes, we love the gray quarter zip. Yes. Wait. Now, are you guys going to the Hold shows on, this weekend? I am on Saturday. Okay, okay. What are you looking forward to the most for that show? Is there any special song, any surprise song you want her to sing? Um, no, I'm taking an 11 year, 11 year old little girl it's her first time mm -hmm. i went to the show in nashville so it's more for her okay oh i absolutely Too love that that's we wonderful that's wonderful you have an 11 year old daughter you have you went to the nashville show i feel like your work could easily figure out if you're skipping or not and this is not even for the show i saw this clip not that long ago 
This isn't for the show. This is for the merch truck? Really? Look, you can be a fan. You can go to the shows. I don't really care. This is a little bit over the line. Just a little bit. We're just going to leave it at that. I hope work didn't find out. Was it worth it? Did you get what you wanted? Let us know. How would you do in today's video? Did you laugh at all? If you did, you lose. There's no punishment. All you got to do is watch again on Sunday. And go subscribe to Zeducation Shorts, where we post all of our highlights, all of our favorite moments from Zeducation from over the years. Let me know how you did down in the comments. While you're down there, please like this video. Please help us get it recommended to others. That's it for today's video. Until next time, I'm Tyler Zed. This is Education. For the children. Idiots.